Sometimes life hands us an opportunity to try something that really challenges us and pushes back on all of our safety boundaries. Today is that day for me because I'm starting an amazing journey of a thousand kilometers with a friend and fellow vlogger who you might know. Getting there. Getting there. Getting there. He was here in Bacolod City from Mascara. I am going to try and together we're going to start this brand new adventure and head to Manila. Hey, good morning friends. My own Aga, this is your traveling tutor, David, and I am at the port of Pulu Pandan. And the reason that I'm at this port is Commander Daot and myself were headed to Manila, but we wanted to go across Gimaras Island this morning and then over to Ilo Ilo City. So this is gonna be the first start of the first video of day one of um, the trip to Manila. This is a new route. And if you wanna take your motorcycle across to Gimaras, you'll have to come to this port. It's off the National Highway, kilometer 24, just south of Bago City. You'll turn right if you're headed south, left if you're headed north, and just follow it for about six, seven kilometers. Very easy to find the port. You'll drive up and come on in here to security. These fine gentlemen will check you in and, and go through your bags and make sure that everything is secure. So this is the first step that you wanna go through right here, thank you. And then after that, you go to the Coast Guard office, which is gonna be up and to the left. If you have a motorcycle, make sure you bring your, your registration. They'll wanna see that along with your driver's license. And that is to the left, down all the way at the end uh, over there. Then after that, you're coming over to the white building, you'll pay your fee for the ferry. Uh, if you have a motorcycle, you have to pay extra for that. You know, very friendly, helpful for check-in. So yeah, go to the white building, and then after that, you'll come over to the yellow building, pay the terminal fee, and after that, you're done. You'll have to just wait until it shows up, until the ferry shows up. Thanks again. I appreciate your help so much. Yep. Step one of our journey. Getting there. Getting there. Getting there. Yeah, this is a nice port. It's not too chaotic. And, uh, you know, not a lot of people here too. So we were able to just walk through it. There's probably days when it's really, really busy, but, you know. Yeah, yeah. We're not here on the weekend. But just. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good time to travel. I time, I time my things to it deliberately. I go to Manila on the weekend. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's fun then, but yeah, gosh, yeah. sometimes traffic can be pretty bad. And yeah, so here, just gonna wait for the ferry. That should be interesting because they're gonna put it on, but on Gimaras Island, they're gonna have to carry it off. Hondo is gonna have special service. <laughs> What's his name? Special what? delivery. Hondo. Hondo. <laughs> I see what you did. Yeah, so this is where you wait. They do have a, uh, looks like there is a CR over here. Yeah. I think you should check out the CR. <laughs> <laughs> There's one available. I don't want to check it out. Build, build, build the whole experience. No, no, no. <laughs> Good morning. Okay, and this is the waiting area for for the ferry. So yeah, if you come here, don't worry. There's CR if you need one right over there. I can't believe how large this pier is. I'm not sure if it's only being utilized by Navamar, but it sure seems like there's plenty of space for other ferry companies. If you're walking to get to the ferry, it's quite a long hike, but my motorcycle made it quite easy to get there. Oh, I'm not driving on. <laughs> okay, it's in neutral. Okay, yeah, put it in first. Yeah, you gotta get the brake. Slowly, slowly. Okay, yep, go slow. All right, thank you guys. Salamat. All right, we're here at the, uh, the ferry. The Navamar Ferry, this is a, like I said, this is a newer route going from Negros to uh, over to Gimaras Island. So yeah, they uh, just loaded up my motorcycle. I don't know how they did it, but it's on here and I'm gonna check it out. So <laughs> I'll get on. Uh, let me get my receipt first though. Okay, all right, thank you. Okay. I'm a I'm a <laughs> Commander, our bikes made it on board. Pretty good, I'm glad 
I didn't have to take it on myself. Was, I, uh, you know, I didn't even dreading it. I didn't even film them putting it on, but I, hopefully. I okay, so they have. Uh, they've got uh, looks like models on the ground that they'll strap the motorcycle to. So guys, if you're gonna take your bike across, it looks like it's safe and sound. I'm pretty happy with this. This is good. I, know, I, thought, I thought this would be good. No, no. I thought they thought they'd have, they'd have it set up. Yeah. But there's always a way. There's yeah. always a, a, you never know. <laughs> but it turned out to be good. The way, well, by the looks of the way, feeling a bit more confident okay. than my last one. Yes, <laughs> well, and that was a larger boat that you took. It was a fast cat, right? It was right? a catamaran. <laughs> yeah, and it was a big was, boat. And that was making me sick. Yeah, this is going to be a smaller one, guys. And but it's only got a single hull. Yeah, yeah. That's, so uh, that's the big difference. So some more movement on this one, but the waves look. Well, I see some white off. Uh, past the pier over there so it There's might a be a little rough hopefully not too rough i think we go that way yeah so, yeah yeah, yeah. Um, do you see where those uh windmills are yeah i think we're going to be in that direction i think so but that island over there that smaller one it's very very hardly inhabited but it looks like a really nice island so someday I, friends i want to i want to get over there and just look at it and see what it is I've been wanting to take this ferry so that I could check out those islands on the way and also ride across Gimaras, but that looks like it's, it would be fun to explore. Yeah. There might not even be people. Oh, there's people on it. <laughs> <laughs> it's uninhabited and it's all drab, right? <laughs> I think I can see houses. I think, I think. <laughs> yeah, way off in the distance. <laughs> well. We'll, uh, we're gonna cast off here in a little bit. Looks like a great start to journey to Gimaras and then eventually to Ilo Ilo City. So the journey continues. We'll uh, show you what it's like on the ocean when we get up in the, uh, we've been invited up to the pilot house. So that'll be fun to check that out. Oh, look at that, black jellyfish. I've seen clear, a lot of clear ones. There is a lot of them too. I've never seen a black jellyfish. Apparently black jellyfish sightings are quite rare from what I've read and researched online, but there's so many of them, I'm not sure what to think about this. Apparently they do have a painful sting, but supposedly it's not debilitating or deadly to people. But this is quite amazing. What a sight to see. Look at how many there are over here at the end of the pier. There are so many black jellyfish. Yeah. Feeling confident with it? Yeah. <laughs> He's like, no, don't. <laughs> okay. Okay. Salam and dog. It's going to rock. Wow. Look at this. Heading towards Gimaris. We're going with the wind right now. It looks like we're headed with the wind. Captain, we're going with the wind. Do we turn right? Go that way after a while? Yeah. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. Let's go back over here. Off in the distance, you can see Bulan Pandan Port. Again, that's a large port, and wow, should be a lot more Roro craft coming out of that. Yeah, look at that. Off in the distance, you can see the uh, the windmills on the eastern side of Gimaras, and these islands over here are they're very small. I don't think a lot of people live on them. That one over there, I do not remember the name of it, but I want to go. I want to go to that island someday and visit it. I want to find out what that is. But in the future, that'll be another journey. But it's so nice that we can come up here and what a view! Should we go up one more? <laughs> I was just talking about that, like, I'm not climbing that. <laughs> okay. I'm not climbing that. Yeah, second story. That's, this, this is good enough. This is a good view. This is fine. I, I feel like a fall. <laughs> I know, there's, there's no railing. There's no railing. Ah! <laughs> The inside of the ferry is very clean and comfortable. There's no AC or upgrades, but the trip to Gimaras Island will only be about one hour. See Kadlaon off in the distance, Kadlan Dog over there. Beautiful day to be out in the ocean. Commander is chatting with the captain. Commander chatting with the captain. <laughs> 
<laughs> Who's higher rig? Oh, yeah. Who's higher rig? Ah, uh, yeah, the captain. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. On the boat. Yeah. On the shore. It's you. <laughs> Navamar just started this new route to Gimaras Island. And in my opinion, it's much easier to day trip from Negros to Gimaras versus going the Ilo Ilo Jordan Wharf route. Check out their Facebook page and message them if you have questions. They were very responsive to my questions and inquiries. It's a windy day today. There was a gale force yesterday. The wind is still a little much, but the, uh, the waves are, are big too. But it's been a nice ride. Very nice. Uh, to travel with Navamar on this route. Okay, they're taking the straps off of Hondo. I have no clue how they're gonna get it off, but they will. <laughs> no crash! No crash! Thank you! I'm happy to be here. trip to Gimaras Island. It's a beautiful day for riding and I'm just taking it all in. In the past I've made four videos about the Nueva Valencia area in Gimaras so be sure to check those out my friends. I'm not going there today but rather going across this beautiful island through San Miguel and then on to the Jordan Wharf. Final destination for the day is going to be Ilo Ilo City. There's so many mango trees on Gimaras Island and I guess that's why this island is considered the mango capital of the Philippines. wrapping way up there. That's got to be 20 feet up in the air. That's a big tree. Who goes up there? Not me. <laughs> 
So yeah, it looks like they'll wrap the uh, mangoes in paper to, to protect it. I love the roads in Gimaris. Four lane roads on their main highway. They're smooth and there's not too much traffic. Being on this island makes me feel like I've stepped back in time to a more relaxing and calmer days of the past. The vibe on this island is chill and it makes me want to stay longer. Once we came into San Miguel, we spotted a restaurant called The Pit Stop, which made mango pizza. We had to stop and try this out. This looked like quite an interesting dish. Uh, Commander was getting mango fever, and it was a must stop in San Miguel. And boy, the food was delicious there. <laughs> Turn my camera on. That's a little... That was dumb. That was very dumb. We're in San Miguel and uh commander you saw the sign delicious mango pizza so we're gonna, gonna happen. we're gonna try it out should be good i hope it's delicious the most important <laughs> okay uh, mango pizza okay thank you. thank you looks like i get two you get none i get all the pizza then <laughs> okay <laughs> all right let's do this <laughs> let's do it okay i got my first gmos mango <laughs> it is good. Yeah, yeah. All right. Oh, this is uh, chicken adobo. Chicken adobo with mango strips. Yeah, and some green stuff. Stuff. No idea what it is, but yeah, tastes good though. Yeah, it does. Yeah, so we are, uh, Commander and I are in uh, that pier, uh, Port of Jordan, and we're getting our bikes loaded up onto uh, Felipe III. But I am in the shade, <laughs> staying out of the sun as much as possible. I don't know if Commander can do it. He's probably more used to the heat than I am. But off in the distance, past the, uh, past the ferry, you can see you can see Ilo Ilo City right over there. All right, going from Gimaris over to Ilo Ilo City. Not really sure where, uh, what pier we're gonna end up in, but I'll show you, we'll figure it out. Um, I, it's not gonna be the fast craft terminal by any means. A 
right, left Gimaris Island. Today's final destination is Ilo Ilo City. I'm back in Ilo Ilo City, and the adventure continues 1,000 kilometers to Manila. Thank you.